So Scump decided to call it and retire early today. Guys, I've been randomly emotional all day. I had a sneaking suspicion that he was gonna retire early, you know, just after all the roster drama, the state of the game and stuff like that. He even joked about it on stream a little bit not too long ago, which was actually the first thing that really put in my head, like what if he decides to, you know, actually just retire early. I know last year was really stressful for him and with this roster stuff, it was even more stressful and he just, I know he hates that stuff. He was even talking about it on the podcast. He said he overestimated the amount of energy he had left to compete for the rest of the year, you know, to finish it out. He was already on a fence about it after Vanguard. This sucks, man. I woke up to this news like a lot of other people. I didn't expect it. I know I still had a little feeling, but you know, I still was like, you know, he's not gonna actually retire. He's gonna finish out the year. They got hoop now, honeymoon period. But nope, I was wrong. In this part of his retirement video, man, this just had my tears flowing. Ooh, I didn't think I was- Not a sad night. Turn that music on. Let's do this. Yeah, bro, you got me tearing up. You got me tearing up, bro. Man. I didn't think I was gonna cry. Yeah. You don't worry, you made me cry. Oh, my She was hard, man. I know something about seeing Shotzi and Damon man just crying and hugging Seth at the end. It just made me lose it. It broke me. I would have broke down in that room. And the way they had the music playing and Seth getting choked up during his speech, I would have broke down. But good news is Dashie's back. He'll be replacing Scump on the roster. Here's how the relationship with him and Rambo is gonna be going forward. But I can't lie, this new roster is kind of nasty looking. Dashi, Hook, Illy, and Shotzi. But what a career Seth has had, man. He, Scump got me in a competitive Call of Duty along with Nate Shot back in the NW3 uh, BO2 days, especially in Black Ops 2 at the old Optic House. He is and always will be my favorite player and also just a huge inspiration to me to, in this whole esports thing. He's the reason I'm a big fan of competitive COD to this day. Competitive Call of Duty is my favorite esports, the one I'm most passionate about, the one I love the most, and Scump has a lot to do with that. Scump, I'm happy for you. I'm excited to see what you do next in content. Congratulations on retirement. I'm sad though, man. I never got to actually see him compete live on land. I was actually planning on going this year, um, either to Optic Major or maybe Champs or just another event this year. But he said he'll still be at events. So maybe, you know, this time I'll have a better chance of actually meeting him when I go. But it's a sad day for the COD scene, man. But we love Scump. I know we all do. He did a lot for the scene. He'll just forever be to go, man. Hit that follow button if you love Scump and if he'll forever be the king of Call of Duty.